today we're doing a super yummy recipe. These are fudgy brownies. I always love when brownies are kind of moist on the inside. So my whole life I've searched for this perfect recipe with the fudgy inside. Um, but I didn't find it. So one day I was craving brownies so badly. I just wanted brownies. And when I was going to do the brownies, I found out one problem. I didn't have butter. So I just made it up and I was like, you know what, whatever, I just want brownies. I want something chocolatey right now. And I remember that sometimes you can use oil. So I used oil for this whole recipe and changed it completely. And actually, these brownies came out really well. So today I'm going to show you how to make those fudgy brownies and hope you will like it. So let's get started. your oven to 350 degrees. Grease a square pan and make sure you get the borders. Combine the sugar, eggs and vanilla. Combine it well until it looks like this. I made a mistake here. You're supposed to add the oil first and then the cocoa powder. But in this case, I did it the other way around. So make sure you add the oil first, keep mixing, and then add the cocoa powder. When you have a mixture like this, sip in the flour, it all well, but be careful so you don't make a mess. When you have a smooth mixture like this, spread the butter evenly in the pan. Then put it in the oven for 25 to 30 minutes. To check if it's done, stick something inside and if it comes out clean, then it is ready. Take it out of the oven and set it aside to cool while we do the fudge. Start by combining 1 tablespoon of oil. 2 tablespoons of milk and 3 tablespoons of cocoa powder. And when it's well combined, add one cup of powdered sugar little by little.
fudge should have a runny consistency. So if it is not, add a little more milk until it is. Finally, make some holes on the brownie with the fork and pour the fudge on top. Now enjoy! So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I hope you liked it. If you enjoyed it, subscribe to my channel for more videos every Sunday. Leave a comment down below on what would you like to see on my next video. Remember, I also have Twitter, Instagram and Tumblr. And I'll leave the links to those down below in the description box. I will also leave below the link to the full recipe in case you want to see the measurements again. If you did this recipe and you liked it, please take a picture and share it with me on Twitter or you can also tag me on Instagram. So remember, enjoy life, be happy and smile. See ya! And share it with me. And send it to me. If you did this recipe, if you did this if you did this recipe, uh, recipe, recipe.